So Mark's found my favourite flower, lily, which is a lily. These are actually known, white lilies are actually known as death lilies because they're often put on funerals. I'm going to fall into the creek. Oh my God, maybe don't do it. We'll find, we'll find a different place. Hang on. And he's struggling, there we go. One, I just want one, that's fine. You can just get me one. Okay. And the dog's barking, the dog's like on high yes. alert. Okay. Fuck yeah, look at them, they're so beautiful. <laughs> Talk about ruining the environment. Lily. Oh my god. Awesome. Let's go. And we got rolling hills. Haley and, and Tobias, the chubby bitch. Okay, we're uh, trying to set up our rooftop sleeping arrangement. Uh, the one underneath was a little bit short and confusing. I think it was broken. So yeah, we leave all our stuff down below. Sleep up top. Good morning. <laughs> We're gonna go see the cowrie trees. We're wearing new shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them. They're sparkling. You got to. Clean, aren't they? We've got to rub mud on those. <laughs> means man and mahuta means basis of foundation did you want to say something profound oh, <laughs> all i was saying was i was listening to this podcast on anthropology and it was talking about how we humans survived more than other humans humanoids because we had the ability to form language and communicate effectively in a social sense so that meant that because of our diplomatic communication skills, we were able to thrive where the others were physically stronger. That didn't matter because they couldn't communicate effectively. Hence, why are we here? Life as we know Hence it. Hence life. <laughs> so the question poses, what came first? Intelligence through communication or communication through intelligence? What are you making for breakfast this morning, Mark? I'm not making any breakfast. Haley's gonna use this on me later. No, I'm making some pancakes. bare feet and just go slop through it. Ooh. <laughs> hey! <laughs> 
Oh, is this like industrial, residential, civilization as we know it in Auckland? <laughs> uh, however, people have to live somewhere. Well, and that's better, it. better intensified in one spot, make everything ugly, and then you can go at the beautiful. This is the copy of like the uh, Sydney. What's it? Sydney Harbour Bridge. Sydney. The Sydney Harbour Bridge, bro. <laughs> Check it out. So intense. <laughs> I knew that that was going to be perfect surf along the Coromandel somewhere. Far out, two inch waves. Hey, it's a quarter of a foot, but it's perfect. What did you get? Oh, got some lemons. We got some lemons from these grommets at the side of the road. Sick! Thanks, boy! We're gonna give it a go, see what it's like. It's all local, so it's, we're excited to try the local food. So this is as fresh as it comes. <laughs> oh my God, look at it. What is it? All it right, here like we go. It looks like it's roadkill. I know. All right, I'm ready. Straight up oh fresh oysters, away you go. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's, that's the take in the shit. That means it's orgasmic. We got our pies, award the award winning, winning gold, star, gold star, gold award, steak and cheese. Like the worst thing. We All didn't right. care, we had to get New Zealand's best. We're eating it together. All right, ready? Just a hint of cheese. Mm. Fragrant, oh my organic, grass fed cattle. Fresh. No frozen. little thing gonna go on stealth into the van, look. Are you enjoying driving, Mark? No. <laughs> Are you enjoying the music? 25, Ben. And, and bloody Lord of the and, Rings and, music. And roadworks. And roadworks. <laughs> We're at Hobbiton. And um, I'm waiting for the party to happen underneath the tree. <laughs> and all the fireworks have dragons and shit like flaring from them. So what do you think, Amy? Detail. The detail. The detail. The detail. It's not bad. The detail. They've got far full time gardens. Well, they have to. And the little house will be as well. The little hobbit holes, there's a 60% and a 90%. So the 60% make the normal size adults look like And the 90% are for the, the hobbits to look normal. Yeah, well, they look hobbit size. Yes. That's how they feel. Yes. And they tore it down, but then they rebuilt it because they obviously realised that they could make them a lot of money from tourists. Yeah, we've we, we heard it through the grounds like cattle. So you'd have like a busload of 30 to 40 people who just get pushed through the ground. You're a statistic, yeah. you're a statistic, and wow, they'd make coin. $80 a year. Oh, yeah, they'd make a lot of money. Thank you, it's the nicest $80 ale I've ever had. Yeah. We have reached the town of Virgil Ruin, mm. and as we can smell, the sulfur billows from the depths of this town. The sulfuric fragrance covers this town. From what? Like a smog. From it could only be made by the geothermal activity. <laughs> 
danger. Thermal activity. Keep to walking tracks at all times. Oh, wow. You can even hear it bubbling. Oh, look at that thing over there. Bad there, Haley. Thanks, About Bubba. <laughs> oh, what? I'm off by a point, oh, am I? <laughs> what? And the, what's judging by the taste? <laughs> pH 7.8. <laughs> this one's boiling. And mix. So where all these people are bathing is actually a mix of hot and cold water. And then where the kids are uh, in the cold stream. So we're at Okiri Falls. Uh, what was this used for, Haley? So power station. So they used the water to generate electricity for the power station. So the town. So Tutea Falls, seven metre waterfall, one of the largest in the southern hemisphere. Uh, we're avoiding it because it's flooded. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> How you going? I'm, I'm excited. Are you excited? Oh no, just a little bit. So what's your first thoughts, Haley? Um, I'm pretty excited to be honest, I think so. But we'll see when we get there. The river looks calm, but it might be more intense. <laughs> it's gonna be good. Fire river, grade four. Where are we? Where are we, Mark? No, there's supposed to be a falls here. It's called Hooker. Hooker? Oh, there it is! Look! Oh! Logging to my left, logging to my right, lots of logging. Mark, I'm taking a video. Um, so we are at the Discovery Lodge up in the mountains because tomorrow we're hopefully going to climb the mountain with snow on top and I will finally play in real snow for the first time ever. Tonight, we are just going to chill for the anniversary, two years, and we're going to make some dinner. Mark's cooking up a feast. We're and in the kitchen, we're by ourselves, we're ruling this joint. Mm -hmm. It's like an old alpine lodge. This is our first paid experience because it's our anniversary and we thought, you know, we'll and we're, um, a lodge. We're plugged into power. We're charging, yeah, everything. charging everything. We've got camping. heating in the van. It's, it's but the right. thing is, like this kitchen doesn't have anything. And of course, Mark staple port. Of course. What are we doing today, Mark? Oh my god. <laughs> You're saturated. We're going up to Whakapapa village and then the ski lifts. Uh, we're not going to go on the ski lifts because they're closed. Yeah, because of the weather. There's we can't even see the mountains. The yeah. mountains are completely wide out. It's a chunk of snow. <laughs> well, I got what I wanted. Go, go, Haley. Do you want, do you want the waterproof one? No. I don't want to escape into outer space. Come here. Hang on, hang on. That is awesome. 
all the veg I have no vegetables. Idea. Growers, it's a growers association. It's like a far, oh. it's a farming thing. We're drinking coffee. Village Battersea with black sand. Now we're right at the tip of Cape Palliser. Uh, we're going to the lighthouse to see the seals. Uh, not too sure where they are. And I just want to survive this road first. I think you found a friend. <laughs> Haley's found all her dicks, all in one spot. <laughs> it's the pinnacles, actually. Oh, it's the pinnacles, that's right. The way is shut. It was made by those who are dead, and the dead keep it. The way is shut. What are we doing today, Mark? We're going surfing! <laughs> Finally, he's going surfing. Oh! Right here, bread capital tomorrow! Bread capital! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Second breakfast. <laughs> that would be shit video. You just oh. <laughs> I got it in the car. Danish rolls um, with jam in them for two dollars. Two bucks for four. Which is awesome. And we got this huge pizza roll. Pakasha. Pakasha, which is they're all made in house in there because it's the bread capital. Tiny raglan, and there's still five people out. How do you feel about surfing in this cold weather? <laughs> I'm not looking forward to it. 
I'm going to put on a uh, one mule rash top, like a wetsuit top underneath my wedding. That's how my fashion is going to look. Thank <laughs> you.